Hey, welcome back to New World Nerds. I'm Superman Nico. And I'm Batman Brandon. And today we'll be reviewing the upcoming superhero movies of 2017. We're in the future. The future. There's actually a lot of superhero movies, yeah. as you can tell. There have been big ones. Yeah. Seven superhero movies. We will be ranking them from least anticipated to most, most anticipated. anticipated. Before we start, we just want you guys to know that we want to see all these movies. Like, oh. really, after the fourth one, I was like, <laughs> they all should be like in the fourth one because I want to see all these equally. Yeah. Yeah. They're all so, going to be good. In no, reality, no. they're all one, 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 one. Yeah. Like, yeah, <laughs> so, yeah. But if like, we had to make an order, this is what we would We'll be out there for that midnight premiere for all of oh, us. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Probably. So I'll start it off. Coming in at number seven, we got Lego Batman. Yes, and this is also my number seven. Yeah. The one we agree <laughs> on. Yeah, that's true. It's going to be dope. Think, it's going to be funny. Yeah. Lego movie is really funny. Batman yeah. definitely one of the I'm highlights of that movie. For the voice actor. Yeah. Yeah, they got, I Will, forgot his name. He's Will Arnett. Really funny. Will Arnett, yeah, yeah, he's great. Yeah, he's oh, hilarious. Man, man. It's going to be yeah. fun to go see him. Rosario Dawson's going to be yeah. Barbara Gordon. Yeah, that's, that's going to be funny. That's going to be. Yeah. I don't know. I like the Lego movies. I liked uh, the last one. Michael Sarah's going to be Robin. That's been oh, super God. hilarious from the trailers. The interaction between Batman and Alfred is yes. priceless. It's going to be great. Just Batman's everyday life. <laughs> and Lego. Like, it's great. Like, this is what Always we want to see. Always be recording. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's going to be great. Coming in at number six for me is going to be Logan. The conclusion for this Wolverine trilogy. It's going to be the last time we're going to see Hugh Jackman. Don't get me wrong. I still very much want to see this movie. It's just I want to see the other ones because they're more connected into other universes. Yeah, I could see that. that. That plays a big part for me. Uh, but Logan's I think last film, <laughs> Hugh Jackman's last film. Come on. All right, the trailer that came out was dope. I like the tone of the trailer. The tone is something we haven't seen yet, really, in a superhero yeah. movie. It looks like a western. The casual people are gonna find out that you can tell superhero stories in any genre. Yeah, true. My number six would have to be Thor Ragnarok. Yep. Yeah, this is one of those movies that it's like in the group of just like the <laughs> top four. Like it's so good, I can't like extinguish it so me just ordering it this is how it would fall i'm excited for thor ragnarok because i like thor the dark world i like the tone of it i i thought there's a lot of good stuff i want to see more like the nine realms i want to see different stuff and then we remember how the ending of thor the dark world with loki and everything so i'm pretty excited yeah to see i mean continues. we haven't yeah. we haven't been in asgard for a few years yeah, now i want so to see ready it. To I go miss back. it i miss asgard <laughs> by the yeah. time thor ragnarok rolls around mm -hmm. in november it'll be four years since we've been there yeah, four years. I didn't know that. Yeah. That's what I was like, four. Yeah. Yeah. Math. Math. <laughs> I also like how they show more physics with a hammer. Coming in at number five for me would be Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. Yeah, I think it looks dope. The trailer's yeah, really good. Uh, we we talked about the trailer a little yeah. bit in one of our other videos. Gal Gadot. Yeah. Wonder Woman, come on. She was definitely one of the highlights of Batman v Superman. Yeah. I like... A lot of the stuff I'm seeing with her out of the Wonder Woman costume as yeah. well. I like seeing the mascara. Yeah, the mascara. Yeah, yeah it's pretty mascara. Cool. Looks like a place mm -hmm. I want to queue up on travel.com. I, I want to go. I actually there. have it queued up right here. <laughs> uh, one uh, trip to the mascara. That's, that's a thousand US credits. <laughs> uh, my number five pick Guardians of the Galaxy Volume oh. 2. Like I said, this is just one of those uh, movies that is up there, and it's uh, like, I want to see it so much, uh, just like the other ones, but when I rank uh, them out, this is just how so it good. falls. Though. Yes. Yes. I, I'm excited. Yes. I want the soundtrack. Is it like that's I'm on board. Get that's it. it. Yeah. Once Get I heard it to it, us. Once you see it in the trailer, you're like, yeah. I'm just this is gonna be the same joy ride that the first one was. <laughs> yeah, and I'm ready. Number four for me, this might be a little bit controversial, but I'm gonna have to say the Justice League. I know on mm, a lot of people's yeah. list it's gonna be number one. And hey, a few years ago it definitely would be number one for me. But the DCEU has lost some of my trust. I'm still really excited for it. Trailer looks great. Everything looks great. But I've been yeah. fooled before. Sure. I am going in with an open mind. Yeah. And I really hope it's great. Everything looks good so it's far. Excellent. I fix your mistakes. My number four would have to be Spider-Man Homecoming. Like I said, this fourth one was just, this was the last <laughs> one that was all grouped together. I want to see this. The new Spider-Man. He's so good. Tom Holland. I feel like he's going to really carry the movie. Um, Michael Keaton as Vulture is also going to be good. I want to see how that they intertwine that. They're going to keep him alive. If not, 
I don't know. I'm excited. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm ready to see it. Speaking of Spider-Man Homecoming, that is my number three. Mm Spider-Man is my favorite character. If you haven't noticed, check out my breakdown of the first trailer. I am so excited for this. I've been been waiting for Spider-Man to be in the MCU for so long. I got in Civil War and I just got a little taste. Now I want the whole meal. I want the whole cake. <laughs> oh, it looks so good. Tom yes. Holland, perfect Spider-Man. Yes. Michael Keaton looks menacing. And the few shots we've seen him so far. It feels like a high school movie and I can't wait to finally see it. Just seeing young Spider-Man. Yeah. It's like finally. It, it feels yeah. like we've got people that know the material behind yeah. this movie and I'm really excited about it. Let's get it. My number three, Wonder Woman. I say this mainly because I'm a DC fan. And Wonder Woman, with that. Nothing yeah, wrong with that. Yeah, Wonder Woman for a lot of people was something that could not work live action. So this is the best thing we've seen. This trailer, uh, all the trailers that are out, it's really hard to make that character work. So if I could see it on screen, I'm gonna have more faith in the DC universe as yes. a whole. So yeah, that's really what I'm waiting for. That's why it's so up there. Yeah, if, if Wonder Woman's yeah. good, that'll bump Justice League up on my list. Oh yeah, for like sure. uh, and it'll a, be a redeeming film for DC. Because yeah. A lot of, they haven't had a really amazing Honestly, track I think it's going to be the first great film of DCEU. Yeah. We're getting to the top of the list. At number two, I got Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, two. and it feels like any other yes. year, this would be number one. It looks so good. Like we're I am ha- Groot. <laughs> I am Groot. It looks like we're revisiting old friends. The transition from adult Groot to baby Groot is going to be great. He looks super cute. I'm excited to see... Star Lord meet his dad. I'm yeah, excited for the rest of the cool. team to possibly end up with the Avengers by the end. Hashtag not if not in this movie then the next. One. <laughs> <laughs> hashtag if not in this movie the next movie. Yeah, I know that's a long hashtag. Here it is, right here. Deal with. I like Rocket Raccoon and Groot. I like how they have the yeah, contrast. And yeah, now he's on his shoulder. Now he's at whoa. Yeah, I like. It's a good switch up. I'm excited. But number two for me would probably have to be Logan, and this is really number two for me because this is apparently Hugh Jackman's last movie. Uh. And he's so old in the role, and just Ugh. it feels so timely. And then the Johnny Cash of the trailer, and it was just just got me in my good spot. Yeah. Like I want to see whole X twenty three. Yeah, X twenty three. We did a little breakdown of that trailer. Also, yeah. go watch us do stuff to Johnny Cash's hurt. Here it is. Drum roll, please. All right, we got my number one. My number one is gonna be. Four. Ragnarok. Oh, I know on a lot of people's radars, this is not number one, but for me yeah. it is. There's so much going on oh, in yeah. this movie. We know that the Hulk's going to be in it. We know we're going to get some hints of Planet Hulk. We want to see Planet Hulk. We want to see Planet Hulk. <laughs> we're going to get the villain yeah. Hela. It's going to be great. Also, kind of spoiling some stuff, we found out in the end credit scene for Doctor Strange that Thor's coming back with Loki to search for Odin, Odin. their father. Yes. Oh. Anthony so Hopkins. we're going to yeah. also get Doctor Strange in this team up. Oh yes. my gosh, we got three A-listers in this one movie. I really enjoyed Thor The Dark World. Yeah, I did uh, too. I know a lot of people didn't like it, but I went in uh, thinking it was going to be something, and it was exactly what I thought, and I was very yeah. pleased. It was just a good two hours. I had fun. I laughed. I saw some great action. Yeah. We got another I like Infinity Stone. I like all the stuff he does with his hammer. Yeah. I like when he jumps out and like, grabs it. I'm yeah. like, dude, that's cool Thor stuff. Yeah. I want to see that. That's, I just want to see Thor doing Thor stuff. Yeah, I want to um, see the red cape. Fuck it. So right. here, I think we're gonna get yeah. Thor's Winter Soldier. I think we're gonna yeah, get. I think, so I think we're gonna get a great film and a great end to a good trilogy. Yeah, I think it's gonna be more well received than Thor: The Dark World. Even yeah. in the posters that they've come out with, it looks really good. Love the director Taika Waititi. I'm glad they got mm. a really good actress to be the villain in Hela. I could talk about this movie all day. You can tell I'm hyped for it. I'm going to be hyped till November when it comes out. All right, Brandon, let's hear your number one. My number one, you already know, is Justice League. Of course. Because as a DC fan, I need this. This is my Avengers. (laughs) I need this to be good. Everything riding on this. Everything. This moment. That movie. I have such an expectation Be here. Oh, it's scary. You gotta be here. I just want it to be good. That's all. Zack Snyder, don't fuck up. (laughs) Batman, not murdering. Have yes. Superman come back with a have mullet, be, possibly? Have be normal Superman. Also, hashtag have mullet for Superman. Hashtag mullet for Superman. Yeah, we want to see mullet. <laughs> mullet for, <laughs> yeah, at one point. But really, the other reason why I'm excited for Justice League because it's really, you're going to see what happens to Superman. 
Yeah. Superman's my favorite superhero. So I'm mm-hmm. actually really tired of all this DC versus Marvel stuff. We're all nerds. Let's no. all be nerds together. Together. Unite. <laughs> That's our list for upcoming movies in 2017 that are based on the superhumans that we love. If you guys' list is different than ours, let us know down in the comments. Hit us up on Twitter. Yeah. Yell at us <laughs> if we really messed this up. Yell at us. Do Please. we? Did yeah, we not give enough love to Lego Batman? Let yeah. us know. No, we hashtag we hate Lego Batman. Let us know which movies you think are going to be great. Let yeah. us know which ones you think are going to bomb. Yeah. Hopefully all sure. of these are good. Fingers crossed. It's a good lineup. Next <laughs> it's a good lineup. Yeah. It is the best time to be a nerd. We are in the golden yeah. age of superhero entertainment yeah. as a whole. And that's only the comic book stuff. There's, <laughs> there's other movies. There's what? other movies. What? <laughs> we'll yeah. talk about that in a different video. But that is all for today. Thanks for tuning in. Follow the channel yeah. on Twitter at, at New, New World, World Nerds. Nerds. Follow me at yeah. Superman Nico. Yeah. And follow me at The Batman Brandon. Make sure to leave a like down below. Always subscribe. Share this with your friends. Get the word out. (laughs) We're always down for a good conversation on Twitter, so hit us up. Comments, more uh, ideas for videos. What movies you want us to review next? Give us a challenge for when we reach 100 100 subscribers. subscribers. We're on our way up, guys. All Uh, the way up. (laughs) And you can stay up. Check out any of our videos, but check out our 2016 rankings from all the superheroes of of this past year. That's all we got for you today. (laughs) Keep nerding out there, true believers. Peace.